Biker TV is brought to you by Harley-Davidson Motorcycle Racing, MotorcycleInsurance.ca, we insure your passion, Pirelli Night Dragon Motorcycle Tires. Welcome back to Biker TV, the best in Canadian motorcycling. This week we're going to stop by Royal Distributing and check out the Ride for Dad in London, Ontario. We're going to go for a ride with Chris and Mike at the Annapolis Leather Barn. But first, we're going hog wild at the Big Balls Dice Run. Welcome to Biker TV. I'm here at Springwater Conservation Area just outside of Elmer, Ontario for our favorite hometown bash. This is the 19th annual Big Balls Dice Run. Leslie. And this is our buddy Russell here. Um, we all, this is the second year that the Big Balls Dice Run has gone on for the LDSA and they are amazing people. They've raised so much money for our charity and we're a completely not-for-profit charity so it's amazing how much uh, money they've donated to us and, and just the um, awareness that we're bringing about for both bikers and people with Down syndrome alike. It's, it's just, it's an honor to and be able to be part of this. It's great to see the people that benefit from the charity out taking part in the event as well. Yeah, so, definitely. Yeah, it's just the, the turnout's amazing. And it's just to see all the bikes pour out this morning for the ride was very nice too. I think there's over a thousand riders. There was a thousand riders registered. Sweet love of God, what have I done? Never turned away the chosen one time. Having a good time? Good stuff. Who are you? Nancy Scratch. And you? Scratch. Scratch? Mackenzie. 
I like how he's just scratch. <laughs> what's uh, what's with the big balls? It's awesome. <laughs> it's a good thing. It's for it's a, a good, good cause. It's a lovely thing. It is for a good cause. You guys are a family? Yes. yes. Obviously. You're the daughter? Yep. What makes you want to hang out with your badass biker parents like this? Because it scares my, it scares all my friends. Yeah. <laughs> it scares all her friends. Uh, you won't have a problem with the boys, will you, Dad? Um. No. She doesn't have boyfriends. And she's yes, not I going do. to have any. Uh, Doug Lonsbury. AKA? Lowney. Lowney. And uh, what do you do? Uh, for a living? Sure. Uh, nothing. Yeah. <laughs> I'm retired. You're retired? For 30 years now. And you organize the Big Balls Dice Run? I help organize. Help organize? Right. Uh, we have a staff of uh, about 35, 40 people. Very good. Me and this gentleman here, Rob Norrie. Rob? Uh, senior members. Senior members? Been since day one, 19 years ago. You guys don't look like you're feeling so good today, huh? Uh, burned out. <laughs> Partied out. Okay. That works too. So let's talk about the Big Balls, 19th Annual. 19th Annual. Uh, here at beautiful Springwater Conservation Area in London, or outside of London. Um, we made a whole whack of money. Last year we donated $15,000 to London Down Syndrome Association, which was awesome. This year, we're gonna smash that, I'm sure. Uh, by the count we got, we had about 1,200 people registered, over 800 on the bike, on the bike ride. Well, that wraps up another kick-ass Big Balls Dice Run. Many thanks to our buddy, Doug Lounsbury, AKA Lowney, and the Big Balls crew. See you at the 20th annual Big Balls Dice Run, and I'll see you down the road on Biker TV. After the break, Royal Distributing. Closed captioning by Hogtunes, audio solutions for the great American cruiser. Welcome back to Biker TV. I'm here at Royal Distributing in Guelph, Ontario for their annual no tax tent sale. Whether it's motocross, cruisers, or crotch rockets, they got all you need to get your riding season underway. Let's go check it out. Today. Uh, somebody asked me if I want to go for a ride. Oh, good. It's, it's a very difficult question. And uh, I'm really glad I did. And uh, this is why. This, this is the is reason why. why. Bikes. Checking out the good Two deal. wheels. Yep. Obviously, you got some friends kicking around. You oh. were heckling me earlier during an interview. All over. He's got to be in there, eh? All over. He's got to get right in there. <laughs> Where are you going from here? We're gonna go uh, golf line back to uh, back into Hamilton to oh, golf line. Pretty down yeah. in there. I like very it. Very nice. Very nice. I needs, babe, I you lost, I've got to let her go. Since I have you here, tell me yeah. your name. Scott Spark. Scott, what do you do here at Royal Distributing? Uh, a lot of stuff. A lot of stuff. Cover a lot of stuff. Good. Yes. You're the man to talk to then. Maybe. What's Maybe. going on here today? Uh, it's just our, I guess, our second last day of our tent sale that we've had for the spring. 
kick off the motorcycle motocross season. So give people some value to come and shop at us. Very good. Looks like it's been a huge success. Seems like everybody's happy. You got the whole A to Z here for everybody. We should have everything for everybody. Mm -hmm. A one-stop shop. One-stop shop. And what's the deal today? No tax. No tax. Right here. That's right. All right. Lots of deals. I noticed you got cruisers and crotch rockets and all kinds of stuff. Imports, everybody's. Imports, Harleys, shop. all the works. We get everybody in here. Everybody. Everybody, everybody welcome. Yeah. Very good. How about Vespas? Are you cool if I, sh if I show up on my Vespa? Why not? What the heck? Why okay. not? <laughs> <laughs> Two wheels, whatever. That's right. Good stuff. Yeah. Well, I'm going to browse. Very good. Have some fun. How you guys doing? Good, good. good. Where are you from? Hamilton. Hamilton. What's your name? Charlene. Steve. What are you guys riding? A uh, sport bike. Sport bikes? Yeah. Are you on the back or are you riding? I'm on the back. You're on the back? Yeah. Nice. You can just relax and check yep. out the scenery. Absolutely. You guys shopped at Royal Distributing before? Oh, I come here probably every year. Very good. Yeah. Very good. Always stuff to be had. Oh, yeah. Some good, good deals. Good, good place to lose your paycheck. <laughs> <laughs> good uh, Ireland. artwork on you, too. Thank you. That's very cool. Half done for now. Half done for now? Yeah. You guys look all hardcore and stuff. That's why I honed in on you. <laughs> <laughs> How long have you been riding? Uh, three years. Three years? Yeah. you do any off-road or anything else? Nope. No, just, just the crotch just... rocket? Yeah. Love it. Yeah. Good. Yeah. Good and fast. Oh! What is it that you do? What's I your name and what do you do uh, here? The Guelph Royal Distributing. What's your name? Uh, let's, let's start proper. Okay. So uh, Brock Parker. And what do you do here, Brock? I'm the manager of the retail store. Oh. Well, you're a good guy to talk to then. Sometimes. <laughs> Sometimes. <laughs> Try to make it all the time. What's going on this weekend? This weekend we're having our annual tent sale. It's uh, 11 days long. It starts uh, last Thursday and it uh, finishes up tomorrow. It's been uh, no tax. It's advertised as the uh, first bike week we've had here at Royal Distributing. But uh, it's been a great success for us. Looks like a good turnout. Oh yeah, so far it's been really good. A lot of happy shoppers. For sure. That's a lot of days. Well, there you have it. Whatever motorsport turns your crank, Royal Distributing's got you covered. Many thanks to John, Brock, Scott, and the team here at Royal Distributing. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time at Royal Distributing. After the break, the ride for Dad. inspiration you folks are to all of us at the Motorcycle Ride for Dad. I, I just get a wonderful warm feeling when I come out and see folks like you joining the fight against prostate cancer. You know it was a few years back when a friend of mine, Charlie Pesker, said to me after I asked Charlie what he's going to do that afternoon, Charlie said to me, Gar, if someone had told me about the PSA test one year earlier, I wouldn't be going home to arrange my own funeral this afternoon. Well, I tell you, I, I don't know what I said to him. I, I, I had no idea that prostate cancer did this kind of thing. Must have mumbled something. And it uh, wasn't long after that, I met Byron Smith from the Ottawa Police Association. And uh, Ride for Dead was born as a result. And this is all about prostate cancer and getting it checked. Uh, but something we've learned, especially now that we've moved the ride to Newfoundland, we've got to ask you to get it checked by a professional. <laughs> <laughs> I know we're a brotherhood. Okay, but there are some things you just shouldn't ask the buddy to do. Or the wife. <laughs> you can get a buddy's wife to do it for you, well then I want to. <laughs> shake your hand, not her hand. I want to shake your hand. So anyway, have a, have a safe day out there. We're going to have a lot of fun. And uh, if you get a chance, come on over and say hi. And uh, we'll see you all at the end. Okay.
And obviously the uh, color of choice for people on motorcycles is black. Uh, I'm very uh, proud to, to be here today because uh, a lot of the work, not all of it, but a lot of the work has been done by uh, police officers and civilians within our organization. And over the course of the year, we're involved in, in uh, dozens of charity events. When you look at a uh, city like Ottawa that, yes, maybe is twice the size, but will have three or four times more riders than London, I know that you have a friend that owns a motorcycle that is probably a male. So I challenge you for next year that we need to double the number of riders. You bring a friend to the ride, and I'll guarantee you this road is going to be closed next year. One of the greatest feelings is to ride through the city behind that police escort, flying through all the stop signs and the red lights. It's a very exciting feeling. There's just one more thing that is more exciting than that. That's when somebody taps you on the shoulder, pulls you over in the corner and says, guess what? If it wasn't for the ride for Dad, I probably wouldn't have got it checked. And guess what? Thanks for saving my life. That's what's more exciting. Thanks for joining the Ride for Dad fight against prostate cancer, folks. After the break, the Annapolis Leather Barn. Welcome back to Biker TV. We've logged a lot of miles so far this season because we can't stop riding back to Atlantic Canada. Today, I'm in Sussex, New Brunswick, where our friends Mike and Christine from Annapolis Leather Barn are joining me for a ride. Let's get this show on the road. Guys are, uh, you guys are joining me for a ride today. We are. Fantastic. Where are we going? We're going to Nova Scotia to Annapolis Royal, Keel, our original store that we started off with in Nova Scotia. Very nice. So and we're, we're leaving the new store. This is a brand new place. Right, in Sussex, New Brunswick. I didn't even get to shop. Oh, you know, another day. Next. Yeah, I was here. I was here. They get, rushed get the me. Store in Nova Scotia. Get yeah, the store. yeah, exactly. That's a cute spot, too. It is. Very nice.
you've done You need to work them out But let her get on with her life again Before she finds out Send me the sounds of a storm in the city Something that you just can't see sometimes She gave you love maybe once in your life When you let her go you don't think about it twice down the road Yeah all before you go There's something that she sees And what's your name? <laughs> oh, he's right on the spot. Oh, now you're going to give me somebody else's name. Yep, I'm just trying to think of a good one. Uh, My name's Pat. And where are you from, Pat? Greenwood. Greenwood, you're a bit of an outspoken fellow. I'm trying not to be. Coming to the dance? Yeah. I was thinking about it. Are you on my dance card? I don't know, am I? Well, it depends how much money you got in your wallet. Does it matter how much I got in the bank? Small feet. <laughs> bank will work, bank will work. You can ride with me, we're going to the bank machine. <laughs> Next week on Biker TV, we're heading east to Atlantic Age. Biker TV special thanks, Parts Canada, we support the sport. Butt Buffer Canada, for the ride of your life. Motorcycle Mojo Magazine, Canadian Motorcycle Perspectives.